G'day guys, we're at this awesome green living garden space down here at the uh, Brisbane Home Show. Thank you for joining us today because we are here at the Home Show and you're watching this channel because that's what you do and I'm just talking rubbish. So, the backdrop's cool, eh? I think uh, I might get one of them for myself. G'day Constructing Artists, it's Kenny here. I'm down at the Brisbane Home Show, it's a convention centre down in Brizzy. Here we go, at the main entrance. Let's go and see what they've got on show. Thank you. All right. One of the cool things about the home show is it has a big variety of things from robots, robot vacuums and roller doors, affordable stone bench tops, good old stuff. They've just got a bunch of everything, which are great for home shows. And this is the first time I've been to the home show in a number of years. We're just working out since 2009, other than being as someone who is a presenter, or, you know, a, a um, we, we had our stall here with Blue Scope. It's the first time we have, I've been here, not as one of them, and being as a visitor. So come down with the kids. Just had a quick chat with Placemate Architects. Ask them about how the industry is going and how things are moving forward. People are quite scared at the moment with cost of living, but what they did speak about is people are aware that the boom in Brisbane for the uh, for the Olympics coming up in 2032 is people need to get their builds done in the next four years. Otherwise, the contractors list, they're not going to be able to get contractors and not going to be able to get builders. So that was great little insights there from the team at Placemade Architects. You can come closer if you like. We won't buy, I promise. That's it, our friends. This is the window. Wow. How it works is this. It's a rechargeable product. You hold it against the window, simply pull it down like that. Here we go. This is my sister, by the way. She always helps me at the show. Is that easy, madam? Down here with New Look, and I've just had a chat with uh, Aaron here who's just moved up from New South Wales and he's, he had a franchise down there. He loves his stuff, told me all about the epoxy flooring system and we're going to get the boys in to do our floor at the, uh, the Constructing Arts Studio in Augustine Heights. So that's going to be exciting to see how the whole process goes. We've got a video behind us. We've got a video behind us. You can see what they do for garages. You can see here's all of our range of all the different colours that they have. It's a really cool system, a really good way of protecting your floor, making it look good and so easy to clean. So I've been watching the block and watching all this. I've seen a few friends of mine that have had that installed and I'm super pumped to get that done. We'll uh, keep you posted with that in the future. Just stopped in here with the QBCC and something that they have going at the moment is a webinar where the homeowner or as a homeowner can go on and find out information, ask questions about their entitlements and their rights when it comes to their QBCC insurance and what the builders should be doing contractually to make sure they, they, they get the build done right. So and when constructing their piece of art, they want to make sure it's done right. So the QBCC has a really good piece of information. They have a bunch of webinars that they're doing and if you log on to the QBCC website, you'll be able to get that information and if you contact us here at Mike Ladders and Constructing Out, you'll be able to get that information. Also, something that we're going to hand out to our clients. Great piece of value that we can add to everyone else. Yes. You ready? Let me get out of there. Winner, winner, chicken. Oh, um, it's the Bunnings voucher. So this guy is actually a professional mascot. That's what he does. I, I will clarify. Uh, I do this on an off basis. Here we have Tradies Network. I actually went to school with the man. And uh, these guys, what they do is they will do a cosmetic renovation. You need a new kitchen. You need a new bathroom. You want to get new painting done in your house, electrical change, new lighting systems, you want all of that done in your house. You need some framing done, 
sometimes as well as they do that as well. These guys have the crew to make it all happen. They've got people on their books that if you need something done in your house, give them a call. They are absolutely great. And Dennis is a man by his word and Michael, absolute legend as well. So if you need something done with these guys, I'd highly recommend them. Five stars from me. So ran into this new company, Brown Line Built Roofing Services. This is a family business based on the Sunshine Coast. These guys do an amazing job of promoting themselves. Look at what they've got, they've got the white, they've got the Hamptons look going. These guys have been in business just on 12 months. They want to make a difference in the industry in the way that they want to put out a really good product. They said they don't want Tracy Grimshaw. I think she's retired now. So they don't want a current affair knocking on the door because they've got a dodgy roof. They just want to go there, put a good product out. And these guys, they're contracting for other roofing companies, but at the same time, wanting and starting to make a name for themselves. First things first, I'll give them a tick on the basis that, look at this, they've set themselves up with a stand at the home show. They're backed with Apex Steels. That's who they got on their, their uh, board there. And using Colorbond Steel, they're gonna go a long way. I'm certainly gonna be sending leads up to these guys on the Sunshine Coast and working with them in the future. I'm very, very excited. This is uh, my most excited part of the day so far. So Brownlow built roofing services. Let's see how they go, eh? Yours. Grab it. About how you can build a garage door and put cladding on the outside of it. All I have to do is weight restrictions and just what you can do, heights, widths and differences. Because I get asked that a lot by lots of people when we're cladding their house because we clad around their garage doors and when um, I've never really had a really good answer to it. So Liam, He's given me some great advice and certainly someone I can send people to now when they ask me the question. Thank you. So just had a quick chat with the team down at Alcom Tent and Security and they were saying about, that, look at this little display here where they've got the smashed glass and um, that's just a clear tent essentially. So by tinting your glass, you stop people from being able to smash your windows and get into your house. Hey mate. Oh, whatever colour you like for the handles because it adds that interest to it. That was all not. Now my clients has worked with Active Constructions for a number of years and they are very, very good. They do a great job for the customer. And Paul, who's the general manager and the director of Aqua Constructions, he's always done a good job and he always considers the customer as the as the person that needs to get the job done and done properly. He does a great job. He's always here at the home show getting good customers coming to him. So if you need a build, a renovation, go down and see the team at Aqua at the home show. And if not Aqua, A-Q-W-A, and uh, maybe you get us on the job. You wanna go home? We'll go home soon. You watch us punch out this last bit. How good is Colorbond Steel? Colorbond Steel is absolutely fantastic. We're gonna go for a bit of a walk into the discovery van and see who we can discover. Oh, what have we got here? The Colourbond inspired by... You see that on the ads on TV, that one. Good stuff. The team from Colourbond, good people they are. Gee, the craftsmanship, look at that, that mitre from there down to here. They've done such a good job on that. There's no Photoshop on that either. It's awesome. Just take you into the Colourbond van. So here's the new Dover light. We've been putting that one on the house out of Space Instructions. Surface, it's interesting having Dover light and surface next to each other. In here you can barely tell. There's definitely a little bit of cream in that one. There you go, there's Southerly and Shower Grey. It's just a little toned down version of Shower Grey. I like it. Here's the big famous sucker over here, the monument mat. We've always got freebies. That's very good. Anyway, we all love our colour bond. That's the reason we came down to the show here. And uh, it's my man here. I know you don't like being on camera, but there he is. This my Cladders wouldn't be where My Cladders is without this guy. We are now here at the Venter Roof stand, which I think, I'm pretty sure is the IRT stand and they've got some pretty cool cladding. So on display here, they've got some monument mat and Lysart clip lock. 
They've also got, which I think that there is shale grey mat in the Lysart clip lock as well. Over here on this one, we have the Dominion cladding, which is a really cool cladding that's got like a 15 mil gap in there with the concealed fixings. Looks really, really good. And they've done a pretty nice job of it here. Then we've got our classic. Oh, and they've done something a little bit funky. We've got a 320 and a 265 next to each other. I like what they've done here. Here you go. The Venter Ridge. Now, as roofers, we all kind of, there's all these things that you hear about. People want to put whirly birds on the roof now. And an alternative option, and it's getting more and more important with all the stuff that we've got going on at the moment, an alternative option for getting your roof space ventilated so it doesn't blow with humidity is the Venter Ridge. Now, check it out. Here we have, this is a piece of roll top ridge, and that is the Vent Ridge product. It sits on the roof, you've got the roof, it goes up into there, so the air flows up underneath the ridge and up into there, ensuring no water gets in. With a typical whirly bird, you're gonna have water potentially coming into the building, especially in a storm, big storm that will blow that off, not with a Venter Ridge. Venter Ridge is a fantastic system that will essentially keep your house breathing fresh air for its entire life. Fine? A hot tub, but have water in there. Hot tubs? Maybe we turn the hot tub on at our place. What? Yes, we do. So I want to massage I just finished having a chat with Andrew, talking about all things Lysart, talking about Aramax, talking about Longline, and a whole heap of um, really cool projects that they've been working on. Talking about Redcore, and talking about how all of these products are available through Blue Scope Steel. So I'm just going to take you on a little bit of a tour through the Lysart stand, which is really, really cool. We're going to first start off over here. What we have here is Weatherline. This one here is Weatherline by Lysart uh, with a custom flash on the side. But Weatherline is a color bond product. You can hear that. All right, it's a color bond product made to look like a weatherboard. Uh, weather is good. Like you can see here, it makes it look like a nice big chunky post. But these are generally used on garages and on extensions on houses that um, where the owner wants it to match their existing, say, Queenslander home or, or weatherboarded house. Here we go. This here is surf mist mat. Beautiful surf mist mat in N seam. I can't tell you because I can't measure that, but I think that looks like it is a 265 profile sheet. Uh, looking great with the receiver channel off the top, running down onto the ground. That just looks amazing. Uh, N seam is one of the original ones in Australia. Lysart brought in and, and they roll that there in each of their capital cities. Up the top there we have the Lysart. That's the 150 quad gutter on their patio system. And they, they, Lysart does a really good job of the patio systems. Over here we have, what color is this one? That is, I can't really say it here. Is it blue gutter? I think it's called. Ah, that is blue gun in there. So that's it's a, quite a, a nice unique gun color with a bit of beachy to it. Here's the bear man. They're right there. There we go. I'm good, man. How are you? So what we have behind us here, that's monument mat in a corrugated iron finish. You might know corrugated iron from being on what? Like every Queenslander house ever. Well, that there is it done in cladding. Monument mat cladding in corrugated iron. Just check it out. I'll get it real close. So from an economic approach, you can go with these these commodity profiles, like the corrugated irons, and get a really classy effect, just like in behind us here. You've got your Italian tiles, beautiful outdoor bench, with a backsplash, the, the wall being monument mat. And that, that's only like 20 bucks a square meter. Quite, I mean, it might be my price. But... Now, if you're wanting a fancy gutter system, if you're wanting something to look really nice on your house, here is the shoreline gutter system in monument mat. It is an easy way to do your barge and your gutter all in one, and it just makes it look fancy. Now, I don't know any other way to explain, but that just looks amazing. You can see that up against that under trim, and that little detail that it has around there has just come off an absolute trick. Patio system, your beams, you got your Bondor panel. So Lysart uses Bondor because it is 100% colour bond. And uh, if you look up there, that is your twin wall system of, of polycarbonate, which is an Ampelite product, which I'm a fan of as well. You know, that's basically it. Oh, 
I really do. What like this? They're right there. Any light gas? This is uh, Aries. Um, the metallic range. And they've used. Uh, no, 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 no. That's just the colour Aries is painted when it comes down to a screw. <laughs> All right, well, we're basically done here. Just going to go gut punch Mark from Hatondo Homes, and he'll appreciate that for sure. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're we're done. Now let's walk out. We're going to find Cameron, and we'll be out of here. There's more down that way. Then. Sure, where? Uh, uh, so warm. G'day guys, we're at this awesome green living garden space down here at the uh, Brisbane Home Show. Thank you for joining us today because we are here at the Home Show and you're watching this channel because that's what you do and I'm just talking rubbish. So, the backdrop's cool, eh? I think uh, I might get one of them for myself. <laughs> <laughs>